it is always possible to determine whether someone's infected with HIV. So you're able to just draw blood out of a person that you suspect is HIV positive and, and find HIV virus in their blood? Yes, uh, even if their HIV RNA is negative, meaning that they don't have any viruses floating in the blood because the genetic material of the virus, when it's in the virus particle, is in the form of RNA. HIV, first of all, nobody's ever found it in a human being. Think of it. The, the so-called HIV tests do not detect HIV in a person. They detect your antibodies that react to some proteins that are produced at Abbott Laboratory. Millions of people take tests that are referred to as HIV tests. However, the idea that there is a laboratory test that can determine whether or not a person is infected with the virus is simply an illusion. Nobody was, was looking at the blood of an AIDS patient and finding it crawling with some new organism and said, hey, this is this virus that we call HIV now. Is there a test that can definitively tell you if you're infected with virus? With the virus, sure. What is that test? Well, you can, you can the, the test uh, is to do the, uh, the ELISA test, which really demonstrates, and it, yes, in essence, it's a surrogate also because it represents antibody production to the virus. But they have demonstrated the virus. They have crystal, they tried crystalline um, uh, models of the virus. HIV exists. Uh -huh.